And new video today from Eagle 8 HD shows just how inundated the city of Northport has been for days now. But there is a bit of good news that water finally starting to recede. Hundreds of rescues took place over the weekend, and city officials say they are still evacuating people as necessary. News Channel 8's Allison Henning is live in Northport once again today for us with the latest. Allison? Hey, so right now I am at a restaurant that sits right along the river here in Northport. I think everyone is relieved to finally see these water levels going down. But if you take a look just behind me here, you can see several homes here along the river underwater at this hour. People who live here, who work here, they are trying to get by, recovering one day at a time. Across the city of Northport, historic flooding following Hurricane Ian has overwhelmed the community. I know that a lot of our friends and family couldn't get out and still can't get out to this day. I mean, a lot of them are trapped in their houses. Here at Tarpon Point Grill and Marina on the Mayaka River, a number of their brand new tiki huts have been washed away. This massive sign out front is face down on the ground, and what was a glass enclosed patio now open to the elements. They pretty much washed away. Um, everything that we've really worked hard for is pretty much gone at this point. But through all of the devastation, this community is coming together, lending a helping hand to others in need. People who've lost everything, you know, kind of trying to share their last can of goods or their last meal or offer whatever they have to their neighbors. It's been really touching and, and really humbling. And city officials, along with their partners, they have rescued more than 800 people from the rising waters so far. We are told by the city of Northport that five people uh, here in the city have died since Ian moved through the area. However, those deaths are still under investigation. Reporting live in Northport, Allison Henning, 8 on your side.